Hey everybody, it's me Becca. Welcome back to my channel. So today, I have to bring you a very controversial topic. So, I was on the internet the other day and I was seeing all these pictures of people talking about some edible cookie dough and I've been thinking in my head, I'm like, wait, it's cookie dough. All of it is edible. But then I realized, I don't know if you guys know this, um, you're not supposed to actually eat like the cookie dough you buy because it even says on thing, do not consume raw cookie dough. I'll show you. So yeah, because supposedly it's really bad for you to consume it raw because of the eggs and all that stuff. But then I was like, wait, does that mean I can never eat cookie dough again? But I love cookie dough, so what do you mean? But then I learned that you can just make eggless cookie dough, which is completely safe to consume, and you can eat it by the bunches. It's completely guilt-free, so you just put your spoon there and eat it all you want and not have to worry about getting sick. Let's see how it works, because I really want to know if, if first of all it's even gonna taste good and second of all if it's gonna taste good because that's really important this recipe you're gonna need some chocolate chips butter at room temperature vanilla extract brown sugar sugar regular water all-purpose flour okay guys so to begin this recipe we're gonna need four tablespoons of sugar I'm making a recipe to feed four because I have hunger of a size of four people Okay, four tablespoons of brown sugar. Two, You're gonna need about six tablespoons of softened butter, room temperature. Next, you will need eight tablespoons of chocolate chips. A little extra. Four tablespoons of water. I have a teaspoon of vanilla extract. 16 tablespoons of flour. Which I'm sure is just like half a cup, but the rest of the tablespoons and I'm timing it by four, so you know. One. And then about a fourth of a teaspoon of salt. And we should be able to mix this all together and create cookie dough. I don't know if this is going to work. Mix and hope for the best. This is a hot mess. Oh my god, this is terrible. I think it's worth just dying. If you want cookie dough so bad, just die. <laughs> okay, it's starting to look like cookie dough. I think I'm gonna go ahead and just add in the rest of the butter, just put a whole stick of butter. Cause the butter really allowed it to start looking like cookie dough. But man, oh man. Okay, it's starting to get there. Oh my God. Look at this. Gonna add some more chocolate chips because at least those will be edible. I don't know, it's actually starting to look like cookie dough. I mean, it smells like cookie dough. I might add a little more sugar to this. I don't know how I feel about it. I'm just gonna add some more sugar. I'm just gonna eyeball this. Alright, guys, so we're just gonna put this in the fridge for like. So just put it in the fridge so it'll harden a little bit. I'm gonna pop it in the freezer just so the process is a little quick. I think I'm gonna give it like two minutes. Um, let's just hope for the best. It looks like cookie dough though. I think I could prank people by thinking it's cookie dough. The taste test. So, I mean, it looks like cookie dough, so let's see if it tastes like cookie dough. I don't know if it's because I put a lot of it in my mouth, but that just tasted like sugared buttered. It was not pleasant. 
I've got to tell you, this is not where it's at. Like, I, I think I, I'll, just, I'll just have cookie dough ice cream from now on because this is not... What do they put in that thing that kills us? It's so delicious. Because it just tastes like, maybe if I get like a little bit. Like, I don't know. It just tastes off. It tastes weird. When I was looking it up online and doing research for this video. Like some people loved it and some people were like, disgusting, it doesn't taste anything like cookie dough. And I think I'm on the side of, it does not taste that much like cookie dough, but there's like, it's like there's something missing. I can't, like there's, you just taste it. Have you ever had a meal and you're just like, this, there's something not with it? Like, I don't know, it doesn't taste right. Yet I'm gonna continue to eat it because it has, like, I don't know. Guys, this is what I want you guys to really try at home. Because I really wanna know what you guys think about this. Like, is it like worth it? I don't know. Like, like I'm really torn. Like if my friend handed me a bowl of this and I didn't have the expectations of cookie dough, I would eat it. But like at the same time, it's weird. Maybe like if I ate it with something else or like, I don't know. Like, I just, it does it taste like cookie dough. Like, but it does, it's weird. It's like Cookie Dough's ugly, weird stepsister, but she's got a great personality, so you hang out with her. I don't know, guys. You guys have to try this at home and let me know how you feel because I am so torn by this Cookie Dough. This is kind of like a no. Okay, guys, if you find any recipes that are just like this one, go ahead and leave me a link or a description or something in the comments below I love trying weird, bizarre things like this cookie dough and seeing if, you know, it's really worth all the hype. Okay, thank you so much for watching.